so in this segment we will learn about uh, detail it is about sharpening and noise reduction I have an image that uh, there is a lot of uh, noise in the image that you can see here there is too much noise in the image so here is the option like you can reduce the noise uh, in both way one is color and one is digital noise uh, if I in, if I boost the color value then it will find out magenta as well as green points in the image and you are not able to see because the image is already green uh, I always use this green and uh, now I will reduce uh, I will increase the luminance for the digital noise and see the result this is before and this is after there is a lot of there is a lot of improvement in the image I will show you before and after this is before uh, here you can find out uh, some red and uh, green dot it is removed uh, this color is removed by uh, by using uh, color noise and uh, this digital noise can be reduced by the luminance detail, detail is about the protecting the protecting the sharpness in the image so again I will come to the sharpness uh, now in the sharpness here is the amount radius and detail suppose I want to increase the contrast uh, sorry sharpness now it is increasing sharpness one thing more about I want to tell you about the sharpness is how sharpness works so firstly let's see how contrast or sharpness works uh, I have an image then I will do something I have put it with the dark gray please keep in mind that dark gray now I will take some more selection and I will fill it with light gray now I will go to filter then uh, sharpen then unsharp mask I'm in the shop Photoshop and uh, Photoshop can sharpness as well as the Lightroom sharpness uh, will work in the same way now I have amount radius and threshold now sharpness increases the contrast around the image in the edges means it will increase the contrast in the edges so as I have increased the contrast it has increased I ha as I have increased the sharpness as it has increased the contrast in the image around the edges so this is the uh, this is the dark uh, gray pixels uh, what we have learned in the contrast dark gray pixel convert into the black and light gray pixels converts into the white points so here is the result with the sharpness and this is the way that sharpness works it will find edges in the image and it will put contrast to the edges and in this way the sharpness increases now I will come back to Photoshop so I'm in the Photoshop and uh, I will increase its amount amount I always use around uh, 70 70 80 and uh, you can do uh, radius up to uh, you can go up to 3 pixels and I always use with 1.5 not more than that if you have very small small details in the image in that you can increase the details suppose uh, what is masking suppose I have increased the contrast in the image and very 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 full sharpness in the image now I want some sharpness in the in this segment and don't I don't want on the on the blurry side on the image that is already uh, blurred that I don't want the sharpness then I will hold alt on the keyboard and I will increase its value then you will see black and white the area where is black that area is not sharpened and the area where is white the area that is very sharpened now I will leave it here and you can see here there is no sharpness and here is the sharpness maintained
so in this way you can put mask to the images I will take one more one more example suppose this is the image uh, that I want to increase the contrast around the hair similarly I have increased and uh, sharpness is increasing around the edges in the image some details I have increased but I don't want sharpness around the already well blurred areas so I will put I will hold alt on the keyboard and then I will drag this point the area that is black that is not sharpen the area that is white that is sharpen so here is no effect of sharpening so in this way you can do you can do your workflow with the sharpness